Alright, so this is attempt number three at recording this narration. It's the 31st of March. Happy Easter, everyone. This is a recording for the 29th of March, where I did my heavy bench, heavy squat, and light deads workout. Um, this is 180 pounds. I am not confident at all. I'm sweating like a man pig, and uh, <clears throat> I'm generally just freaking out and wondering whether or not I'm going to hit the lifts. No, actually, that, that's when I was walking into the gym, but afterwards I just kind of forgot about it and went into the, into the lifts. Now, I think I'm not super confident about my foot placement uh, on the floor there. And uh, I'm wondering if I'm losing any transference of energy to the lift. So, see the first uh, rep went up, the second went right up quite easily, and I'm, I'm lifting my ass off the bench, yes. Uh, at this point, I don't really care. I want to get the uh, I want to get the weight up so that I can move on with this. So there you go, six reps. Not so bad. Now these benches are very slippery, and I'm gonna have to find the. Uh, Jay Shaw had uh, suggested a type of uh, material to me, and I'll have to look back in the uh, in the logs and see what the name of it was, but I'm going to have to get us a, a bit of it to put on the bench as uh, they, uh, they're they slippery and uh, I'm losing some tension in my upper back because of that. I'm also uh, learning how to, still learning how to uh, wrap my wrists. I think I'm getting better at it. I'm not just actually wrapping the wrist itself, I'm actually, my first pull will go down on my forearm a little bit. The second pull through will go up to cover my entire wrist, and then the third wrap round covers the uh, covers the bottom of my hand, so it keeps the uh, keeps my hand in well, pretty much as I see it now. So the second set, uh, I've taken about a five minute rest. That still fatigue set in pretty quickly. By the fourth rep here, it's yeah, a bit slower. Five. A bit of a push, I rest for a second, and then six, I push all the way up. Again, the image that I'm fighting in my head is that of not being able to get the, the weight up uh, for 170 that one day. So uh, that's kind of my um, motivation, I guess you could say, to get this up. I'm sorry if there's sound in the background. My girlfriend's up on the second floor vacuuming. And it's so fucking loud that it come down here to the, to, the, to the basement. And I have crap going on here in the basement too that I can't really show off. So Now you see on the left there, there's another guy who sets up. And he kind of brings the uh, the rack forward. Don't, don't please excuse his crappy bench. Um, you'll see that I don't use that. You'll see that I, I lift up and then pull out instead of pulling out first. And that's because the bench that I'm on right now, I'm not confident in the fact that it will actually fall back to its original position. So I just don't want to deal with being stuck uh, out front and this stupid lift-off bar is still out in front with it, so I can't bench. So you see, I kind of try to start to I try to start doing my reps a bit too fast and uh, like to slow myself down. Now, last one was a grinder. Um, although I'm sure it's not a grinder. It wouldn't have been as much of a grinder as if I put 225 on there and tried a one rep max or something. But as for me, it felt like it was a grinder. And I think I'm just putting a lot too much emphasis on the fact that uh, I need to I need to bench and I have to get this bench. Uh, uh, I have to get it up. And, they just need to sit and, and do it and let the chips fall where they may. So, squats. Um, now, I have a problem with my left rotator cuff uh, in certain positions. It hurts. Um, and I think that squats is part of the, uh, the reason. So, any suggestions that anyone might have uh, for my grip on squats would be greatly appreciated. Um, if I put my arms out too wide, if I put my hands out too wide, I lose stiffness in my upper back, and I guess that's just because 
I haven't practiced it enough, but I have tried it before, and it's a little disconcerting. So, um, oh god, she's not okay. This is like I said. This is the third time I'm trying to do this narration. So, um, yeah. So, if anybody has any any, because I try to get it in as as tight as possible, so that I can keep the tightness in my upper back. But if going out a little bit wider would make more of a difference, then, then I'll, I'll start practicing and switch to that. But I think I think what may be hurting my rotator cuff is the uh, is is my squats. And, uh, I'd, I'd just like to get that fixed. So I, don't, I don't see anything terribly wrong with my with my reps. I'm trying to go. Uh, Break, break parallel or at least hit parallel. Um, and my chest rise uh, as quickly as my hips do. Uh, and try to pull down a little bit with uh, with my hands in the hole. I think I'm starting to get that. But, uh, didn't get a third set recorded because because of that. Have a great day.